As city leaders and local advocates push to equip all Fort Wayne police with body cameras, we're asking who will be allowed to review the footage. Tonight, a body camera ordinance will be introduced to Fort Wayne City Council. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Caitlin Kendall. And I'm Brian McElhatton, ABC 21's Jeff Newmyers, live with continuing coverage tonight. Jeff. Yeah, Brian Kalen, no vote on the ordinance tonight. No discussion either, just formal introduction. Three of nine city council members are sponsoring the measure, two Democrats and one Republican. The ordinance calls for really uh, outfitting essentially the entire city police force with the devices by no later than the end of 2022. Protesters and citizen groups nationwide are putting pressure on departments to ramp up body cam usage to better document police conduct when in particular officers employ deadly force. We're told it would take a commitment of about one million extra dollars to expand the body cam program for Fort Wayne PD. Reverend Karen Staten with Faith in Indiana supports the idea, but her group wants suspensions given to officers who fail to turn their cameras on during traffic stops and other interactions with the public and believes officers who don't have the camera on when using force should be fired. It does provide some accountability and some uh, transparency. Uh, but the problem is they have to be turned on. And it is up to the officer to turn the, the, uh, the cameras on. And, of course, there needs to be some consequences if they're not can, turned on. Uh, obviously, we have a disciplinary review board. We have the uh, internal uh, internal affairs board that uh, that investigates. So, uh, and then the the chief as well. So, yes, there are there are different uh, groups that already review these types of videos. Now, Russ Yale, a sponsor of the new ordinance, says it's good for police because it reduces the chance of frivolous lawsuits when uh, officers are shown to have acted appropriately, but also can restore trust, he says, for those who've lost confidence in police. We reached out to Mayor Henry's administration today, the city telling me it's premature to get into exactly who would have a role in reviewing body cam footage since the ordinance has not been ratified yet. Reverend Staten wants a new citizen review board created that is not appointed by the mayor. Uh, that uh, would then have uh, authority in, re de in determining whether police are uh, justified in the use of force in specific cases that would be analyzed. Staten saying it's difficult for police to police themselves. Brian, Caitlin, back to you. All right, much more to come on that, Jeff. Thank you.